I like to start every show. I'm a business coach, uh, Christine, and I work with people all over the globe who are successful but stuck. I like to get them unstuck. And so I love this podcast because I get to have guests like you that also are in alignment with my mission to help them get unstuck. And so where's a recent stuck and how'd you get unstuck? Oh, so I just opened a co-working community. I bought a commercial building and of course you have it. What are you going to do with it? So I created, I mean, I, I want a community myself, right? After COVID, I was feeling a little sad and lonely. Yeah. And so I said, okay, I'm going to create this cool co-working space. And I did all sorts of stuff and threw all kinds of things at it. And I didn't understand why people weren't flocking in because it's beautiful yeah. building. I have, even if I do say so myself, I did a great job with it. Yeah, right. And so I had to do right what you have to do, go out and actually speak to people who I thought were my clients, find out what they were thinking, what they were doing, why they were staying home instead of coming to my beautiful space. And you know what I discovered, John, you, you might not believe this. They didn't know what co-working was. Yeah. They'd never heard of it. So they're like, yeah, whatever, you know, co-working space. What the heck does that mean to me? Yeah. So that changed everything, all my advertising, the way I had to communicate with people. It was right. just a whole different style of communicating. And I came from the city where everybody knows what co-working is, but here in the burbs, they're not familiar with it at all. Yeah. You know, you bring up a really good point. Um, and I talk about this a lot with my clients. I talk, we talk a lot about this on the podcast, which is we have to define things for people. And in today's world, um, you know, attention spans are less and people are more distracted and people are more overwhelmed. And, you know, there's there's all of those issues. And so we do we have to make it make it simple, take the thinking out of it. Uh, and so redefine. Yeah, I love that. So thank you. Thank you for sharing that Think community. So important to uh, make sure you're defining even the simplest of things. Uh, you've heard me say this many times. Keep things to a kindergarten to second grade level and you're you're right. You're you're good to go.